right, so I got the SanDisk flash drive in that had been worked on previously. Uh, taking a look at it, first things I noticed right off the bat are the clock appears to be completely shot. Um, trace going to the controller over here for the data line is shot. Trace over here is shot. Via over here is shot. These pads are pulled. Uh, and it looks like this board has been heated up because you can see it's a uh, discolored from the rest of uh, the circuit board. They also took the memory chip off for me, which was nice of them. It saves me the hassle. So I am going to, rather than try to fix that circuit board, I have a donor circuit board right over here. The only difference is that my donor circuit board is for 8200515-4, and this is dash five, but the circuit board is identical. So let's pull the controller off and move it to our donor circuit board. Let's add some flux there. So uh, this controller has a heat pad underneath it, which is going to make it a little bit more tricky to remove. It takes a little bit more heat. And it acts a little bit like suction. All right, cool. Let me add some leaded solder. Let's make it easier. To attach the controller. All right, and pull this guy down. Let's attach the memory chip. This is actually the same flash drive from another one of my videos. But they were kind enough to let me keep this as a donor.
think all the bridges are taken care of. Looks good. Looks good. Looks good. Attach our trusty USB connector. And the other data line, no, that's plus five. And the other data line, and then since we have broken trace for plus five, we're going to attach it to the fuse over here. All right, let's see if it works. Since there was all this damage done, let's check for a shorter ground first. Good, nothing. All right. And it does not work. First obvious question, did I screw up somehow? All right, so there's no blinking light. Okay. So it doesn't look like there's any power going to it because the light doesn't come on. Let's make sure this fuse is good. Okay, I think I know what it is. I think we need a little bit more solder over here. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, we have a light. And we have data. So that's transplanting a NAND memory chip and controller from one circuit board to another on a SanDisk flash drive.